Hey guys, my name is Elena, I'm a graphic designer and welcome to my channel about a graphic design. And today I'm going to show you how to draw this flat character of pregnancy woman and without any sketch. You need only reference photo and you will find this photo below this tutorial. And if you're interested how to draw this flat character of pregnancy woman in Adobe Illustrator without any sketch, then keep watching. Let's start our tutorial and now some words about these colors. You will find these colors below this video in iFile. You need to select these colors and move them to the swatch panel. Select icon with three lines, new color group and OK. And voila, our colors here in the swatch panel. And let's start the tutorial. File, place. Select the photo, place, hold and drag, move to the center and layers. You, you need to lock the layer with the photo, here it is, lock it, ok. Now select this color for our skin and pen tool and let's start draw the face. Guys, if you can't work with pen tool, I have pretty good tutorial about pen tool and you need to start with uh, this tutorial, with that tutorial and then go to this tutorial. And if you can work with pen tool, let's move on. Ok, now we need just the shape of the face, like this. Ok, now you can to you can draw ugly like this because it's unvisible part now select direct selection tool and you need to round corner here like this okay now change stroke to fill here fill to stroke and now select the color for the eyebrows and egg and pen tool and let's draw here eyebrow you need to draw more bigger eyebrow because it will be more pretty here okay and you can add some shapes here to add more realistic view our eyebrows eyebrow sorry it's only one just these small triangles with help of pen tool okay now select direct selection tool and Hold and drag and round corners like this. Okay. Now we need this color and draw here the shadow. Like this. Okay, round the corner here, 
with direct selection tool and select the color like eyebrow color and draw here uh, the shape of the eye like this let's move this corner a little down with help of direct selection tool okay now let's look select the face and fill to stroke to fill and uh, again fill to stroke okay now the lips select pink color and pen tool and draw here the shape of the lips like this it's okay here beyond the face it can be pretty ugly now change stroke to fill and let's select dark selection tool and move this point a little down like this now copy and paste the face select the copy of the face and the lip and pathfinder intersect okay now change again fill to stroke and again this color and here we need to draw the second part of the lips like this now again stroke to fill copy and paste the face select the copy and this lip finder intersect okay now let's draw teeth select white color and pen tool and draw here the shape like this it can be pretty ugly this way now copy and paste the face select this shape and finder intersect move the lips in front okay and now we need to fix here these parts must be unvisible so you need to select direct selection tool and move these part, uh, parts like um, under the lips and teeth this way just select unwanted parts and move them like this okay guys and here we need to round corner now it's great let's uh, select the face and here fill to stroke and select this color for the hair and curvature tool and let's start to draw here the hair I like this tool because it's uh, create pretty smooth and soft lines. Like this, you see? No corners, only smooth lines. And now here in the in the end you need to hold odd to close the path and select direct section tool and rotate uh, around uh, this corner okay now here stroke to fill and here stroke to fill i think the face and the hair is pretty um, are pretty now again fill to stroke and 
select the color of the skin and pen tool and let's start draw uh, the hand guys we don't need 100 percent much we just need uh, the shape of the hand so uh, you can draw uh, the shape of the hand with some changes it's okay it's not a portrait we are creating a flat character so like this all corners and bad shapes will be fixed don't worry about it just draw the shape like this all corners will be rounded it's pretty fast way to draw the hand okay and now close the path now with direct selection tool move this point and here change stroke to fill now let's fix these shapes with help of smooth tool let's move a little uh, the hand here now direct section tool select these two points and round corners now select this corner and you need to round it the same here okay here the same and here here is okay and here is okay now here to round corner and uh, here you need to round corners now you see here we can round the corner and here we need to select smooth tool to round this corner select the hand smooth tool and just move the smooth this move to like this and we are rounded corner okay now change here stroke to feel and let's look i think it's pretty now let's start to draw the body select this pink color and pen tool and draw the shape like the body of the girl as i already said invisible parts can be not very pretty and here we need to draw pretty well don't be afraid on all corners will be fixed with help of direct selection tool it's pretty easy shape to draw it's pretty easy shape to draw like this and like this the neck and here it can be ugly now let's change here stroke to fill and let's fix the corners with help of direct selection tool hold and drag and to round every corner okay i like it uh, now again to stroke and let's make it 
closer, select the color of the skin and pen tool and let's draw the hand here. It uh, must be pretty easy because it's a flat character and we don't have to have here many details. It must be pretty easy but stylish. Like this. And now stroke to fill and we need to round corners on the fingers with direct selection tool. Okay. And now let's again change stroke fill to stroke and let's draw the nail here direct selection tool you need to round here like this and here a little now select that color without stroke and copy and paste the nail move here rotate it make it a little smaller copy and paste okay now let's change stroke to fill now copy and paste again this nail make it smaller move here again paste the nail make it bigger change here stroke to fill fill to stroke and move the finger here in this place and again stroke to fill copy and paste uh, sorry paste again the nail and move here make it bigger okay now change here stroke to fill move the hand in front okay now again select the body and change here fill to stroke and select uh, the color of the body and pen tool and draw here neckline dress like this okay now change here stroke to fill copy and paste the pink part select the copy and this part and pathfinder intersect okay now let's uh, select sorry um unlock the photo move it here move these parts to back okay and now let's select this color and pen tool and draw here one more part of the dress Okay, now copy and paste the hand, select the copy on the hand and this part and Pathfinder intersect. And for this part select this color. Okay, now select uh, this dark pink color and here I'm going to draw uh, the shadow.
okay here it can be ugly and here let's close the path like this now copy and paste light pink uh, dress and select the copy and the shadow and pathfinder intersect and move these parts to back okay now select direct selection tool and you need two round corners here to create more smooth shadow I like it now let's add more shadow the same color and pen tool and draw the shadow here Now select the dress, copy and paste it, select the copy and the shape and the finder intersect. Ok. Now let's uh, draw the hair. Select this color and curvature tool and draw here the shape like this. I want to create long hair for my girl and move it back let's uh, move the hair like this I love it now select again this color in the stroke and again curvature tool and let's draw here some hair like this and one more here if you don't close the path you need to press escape to exit curvature mode and here select stroke this shape and here 5 and the same here select this and here this shape and the same 5 um, let's um, better make here 3 it will be more realistic okay now let's move the photo here and you can delete the photo we don't need it anymore and now let's add details select this color and pen tool and draw here just the line like this escape and select this brush and the same here escape select the that brush and you need to round corner here one more detail here And one more here. Okay, it's pretty good. The woman is ready. Now let's add details of our design. Select uh, this uh, color and rectangle tool. Hold Shift and make the square is the background and send it to back um, now select green color and ellipse tool hold shift and make the circle now hold odd 
and make the copy move it here now we need here this part so select both circles pathfinder and intersect make it bigger move here now select pen tool and draw here triangles like this and like this and one more here and one more here okay now select all shapes for finder exclude ungroup delete unwanted parts and select direct selection tool and round all corners like this now select um, pen tool and we need to create here the straight line just like this now escape select here light color and here we need this shape I think 5 is pretty good and select this button and now let's sorry let's select the leaf and um, rotate it and group it ctrl G move here like this make it smaller rotate it okay move the leaf and background to back and i think i want to make this color brown it will be better and let's a little play with the leaf a little bigger and a little up okay now transform reflect vertical copy and move here now with direct selection tool select green color and now make it orange okay uh, now let's select that color and pen tool and draw some small green leaves like this Okay, and now select orange color and ellipse tool and draw some small ellipses. Okay, and let's make this and that brown. And now let's um, select the girl and all design, sorry, without background, select the girl without background and move down like this. Now select this white color and ellipse tool draw here two small ellipses here some ellipses to create the cloud like this now select all these ellipses and for finder unite now select dark pink color and rectangle tool hold shift draw rectangle hold shift and rotate it like this and select 
these two and hold shift and make the heart and here we need to round corner and move make it smaller and move here okay now let's um, create the clouds select egg and white color and ellipse tool and create three ellipses like this select them all to finder unite and uh, rectangle tool we need to cut off the part of the cloud select both parts and pathfinder intersect okay move here uh, effect warp flag and here 21 horizontal okay object expand appearance now select it and move here copy and paste it make it smaller move here and transform uh, reflect vertical okay and again paste move here uh, make it a little smaller okay now let's add some details uh, select dark brown color and pen tool in the stroke we need dark brown color and here let's draw like this escape and this brush and rotate oh sorry round the corner and the same here like this escape that brush and direct section tool and to round corner okay now guys if you want to select uh, the design and uh, change the size you need to go to object and expand appearance and now you can make the design bigger or smaller and and all proportions will be the same and you can as well move the details as you like for example like this to make it more pretty well guys our pregnancy woman is ready that's all for today guys if you like my tutorial please give me a like and subscribe and see you in the next tutorials in adobe illustrator or in the next videos about a graphic design bye bye guys Mwah. bye